We're back again. Mm. So within the last 20 minutes, a man has sent me this post via Instagram. He sent me a quick DM. So senior police officer who wrote the drug strategy accused of smoking weed daily and that. I don't give a fuck, fam. Like, why is a man sending this to me? Now, obviously, you get me? I like to know what's going on in the, in, in the community and I, I like to know what's going on in the outside world and that. But I don't give a fuck, blood. There's good and bad everywhere. You see, when a man sends me this sort of post, it's almost like he's trying to play like a point scoring system. Oh, look, the police aren't so good and we aren't so bad as black people. Look how the police are acting. There's corruption in the police force. Of course there's corruption in the police force, fam. Do you think I give a shit, blood? You should, you should done know the police are fucking corrupt. Like, you should done know the police are fucking bending the rules, fam. Yeah, what, well, you're not from the ends, blood? Like, you don't know that there's police officers that take a little couple ten bags of weed off of the man them and, and go and smoke it themselves, blood. you never seen them post there where I even made a video about it. I don't know if I've released it yet. Where basically there was four police officers, Asian police officers. I think they might be from London, maybe. They might be the Met police. But anyway, they were um, running up on drug dealers when they were doing like a little exchange and that. So you had a couple men go to link a couple drug dealers and that to exchange money and buy drugs and that. And they was running up on them, taking 60 grand worth of drugs from them. Yeah, There's corruption in the police force, fam. There's even corruption in the government, blood. You had all Boris Johnson and that telling everyone, oh, lockdown, lockdown, lockdown. And they were secretly uh, throwing up and doing up parties on sly, blood. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a damn if there's corruption in the police force, fam. When a man, certain people, when they see sort of posts like this, yeah, they get happy. Oh, look, the police, they're, they're doing this, they're doing wrong and that. Because you know, you're, well, the, peop, the reason why people them are happy when they see posts like that, because they know the black community is failing, blood. Stop watching what the police are doing, blood. And understand and adopt the mindset that the cleaning starts at home, blood. You got black people talking about, oh, we need to teach the police how to handle black people. No, why don't we teach black people how to conduct themselves? You see, if black people knew how to behave themselves and that, you wouldn't even be encountering the police, blood. I don't need to figure out some sort of strategy how to handle the police when I get stop searched two, three times a month. I don't get stop searched two, three times a month. Do you know what the strategy is to handle police? Where um how to handle police when I get stop and search three times a month is to get on the right path. Be a legit, be a positive person. That way you avoid the police full stop. I was even talking to a woman about this today. I met one tenant on a job. She's um a psychologist and that. And I was talking about depression and I was saying to her, I don't believe depression is real. And I also do not believe black oppression is real. And she was saying that, nah, I see the way the police handle black people now. Now, she wasn't black. She was from Romania. And she was like, I've seen the way the police handle black people now. And I'm saying to her, okay, yeah, the police are handling black people a certain way in that. But why are the, because I think this, she was saying that the police are pulling out guns on black people and that. Well, why are they pulling out guns on black people? You have to remember, there's no smoke without fire. Maybe black, these black people are suspected of having firearms and that. Yeah, police, I've never had the police pull out a gun on me. I've had the police pull out a taser on me because I was suspected to be holding something long, innit? Yeah? So that was the only time I had the police pull out a taser on me. But as far as guns and that, I've never had the police pull out guns on me. No, because I've never been suspected to have a gun, blood. Like I said, I had the police pull out a taser on me. Even, yeah, yeah, I don't want to talk too much on that. Well, I mean, there, there was no charges anyway. But basically, you get me... Some false allegations, false allegations, false allegations of that. And the police come to my house and you get me, they say, come to the door, put your hands up slowly and you get me, bring them down slowly, whatever in it, yeah? And I did not get tasered. I just got arrested in that. And there was no case to beat because it was a false allegation and that. that. That's the only time I had the police pull out a taser with me because someone made up a story, blood. Yeah? I don't give a shit about the police uh, getting caught for smoking drugs. And who gives a shit, blood? You should done know the police be smoking drugs, blood. You should done know your fucking MP, your prime minister. I'm not saying the current prime minister. I, you know, I ain't even talk about the prime minister. But you should know the local MP is watching child pornography, blood. I'm not saying it's right, obviously. But what I'm saying is these things happen, blood. Yeah? People are not perfect, blood. Yeah, obviously, man for not be <laughs> um, watching them things there, innit? But as far as the smoking weed and that, fam, come on. Come on, blood. You, you, you should expect, 
you should expect this to be going on in the police force. You think every single police force, every single police in the force are drug free. Come on, man. Come on, blood. Come on, man. If they're not doing weed, they're doing some sort of drugs in that. So I don't understand what this post proves, blood. This post don't prove nothing. This post is not going to help black people get on the right path, blood. Why do you, and like I said earlier, why do you care, fam? Why do you care what's going on in the police force, fam? You see, whether the police are corrupt or not corrupt, I'm still buying properties, blood. I'm still elevating. I'm still making progress. I'm still increasing my assets and my net worth, blood. Yeah? People are running around and worried about what's going on in the police force from, one, from what's not going on in the police force. But that's not helping your bank balance, blood. That's not helping your children, blood. That's not putting money in the bank account that you have not set up for your children, blood. Yeah? Man need to focus on the right thing, blood. Yeah? I'm, I'm not interested in what, what's going on with the police, but I don't really give a fuck, blood. I'm, obviously, man make videos about this to educate the people them and that. But, blood, I don't really give a shit. Yeah, it don't mean nothing to me, fam. So, yeah, the, the, the police could be smoking up trees. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck if, was it Cressida Dick, whatever the her woman's name was? I don't give a fuck if Miss Dick had a grow in her yard, blood. What's that got to do with me, fam? What's that got to do with me, fam? I don't give a fuck who is the prime minister of the country. I don't care if it's Rishi Shunna. I don't care if it's... If it was Margaret Thatcher, I don't care, uh, Tony Blair, I don't care about none of these people. These people are not helping me progress, fam. Yeah? I don't give a fuck they could bring back Boris Johnson. That's not going to help me progress. That's not going to help me. That's not going to make me regress. Yeah? you got to realise, yeah, your destiny, you get me, your, your outcome is all dependent on yourself, blood. Don't worry about what's going on with the police. You're going to be a legit citizen, yeah? Don't worry about what, what's going on with the police. Don't worry about the government and that, blood. Just focus on yourself, blood. This is the problem. We're too focused on other people. I, I was watching something yesterday, or I was doing a reaction video to something yesterday. I can't remember, in it, And it was talking about going around trying to help other people when you're supposed to help yourself. Yeah, that's, that's the problem. I say it all the time in my video, isn't it, yeah? Black people, what we want to do is we want to go around and fix other people when we should be fixing ourselves. I've said it many times, I'm going to say it again. The way to cure the black race and fix the black race is everyone look in the mirror and say, do you know what, for the next five to ten years, I'm going to work on being the best version of myself. I'm going to work on being the best version of myself. If everyone just looked in the mirror and said, you know what, I'm going to work on being the best version of myself, I'm going to be the best mother or father, and I'm not going to do anything illegal, Problem solved, fam. Nobody makes you do anything illegal, blood. To some, to, to, yeah, to most degrees, yeah? Because I know some idiot's going to come and say, well, da, da, da. shut up, blood. No, no one makes you pick up a gun and go rob someone. No one makes you go and smoke crack. No one makes you fucking do bank fraud, yeah? You, you decided to do that yourself, blood. So we as black people only have ourselves to blame. Nobody else. Nobody else. So what? Yeah, let the police start smoking crack. How is that going to help you, fam? How is that going to harm you, fam? Yeah, they're hypocrites in that. But aren't you a hypocrite, blood? We're all hypocrites in some way, shape, or form, blood. Yeah? We say one thing and do another. Yeah? So let, let them be hypocrites, blood. Yeah? That, ain't, that is not helping you. Yeah? A pulse like this is not helping you become successful and it's not stopping you from becoming successful. So you know what? In the grand scheme of things, it doesn't fucking matter, blood. That's it, blood. Stay away, done now.